looks as if he actually noticed the difference. One thing's for sure, this action is a key scene in this little adventure. finger in one of these when I was younger. The board is nailed down. Is the offer with a boat and the whiskey still good? Sure. Then I have something for you. Thanks. It won't last very long. But I wanted to head out in a while anyway. I'll just take off as soon as the bottle is empty. Please just tie the boat back up once you're done with it. Sure, no problem. And thanks a lot. You've helped me more than you can imagine. You too. Everything here is completely overgrown and looks rather run down. I wonder if Morangi still really lives here. Hello? Hello? Is someone there? Help me! What are you doing down there? They locked me in down here. Please help me and get me out of here. Sure. Uh, but how? No idea. Think of something. But I've sprained my ankle and I'm not 30 anymore. So don't just throw me a rope. I never managed to be able to climb one back when I was in school. Is there a ladder here somewhere? I'm afraid not. But there's a door down here that I can't open. Maybe you can find a way to open it from the outside. Sure, no problem. How can I get to that door? You're going to laugh, but I have no idea. I've never been down here before. And I have no idea how to get to the well from the castle. There must be a secret passage or something like that somewhere. You're Ken Morangi, aren't you? Yes, I'm Lord Morangi. Why? If you live here, you should know your way around here, shouldn't you? Well, I always thought that too. Okay, I'll take a look around. Thanks a lot. I'll give it a try. Maybe I was King Arthur in a previous life. Oh, that surprises me a little bit. Yikes. I only wanted to close the window shutter, and already I'm holding the whole thing in my hand. This place really needs a major overhaul. The painting is of Lord William Morangi, who lived here from 1270 to 1305. What an impressive guy. I ask myself why the chair is in the middle of the room. A small stool. It seems as if this fireplace has not had a fire burning in it for a long time. Most of the books don't really interest me, but here's a book about haunted castles. It talks about Morangi's castle. It says that there's a rumor that William Morangi, who lived from 1270 to 1305, was buried without the usual customs and traditions, and they even refused to give him a funeral pyre. He was entombed in a sarcophagus wearing only a simple robe and his family's amulet. 
They say he's been walking through the castle and seeking revenge on intruders after midnight ever since. Even if I don't believe in ghost stories, I should probably finish rescuing Morangi from the well before midnight. The statue is massive and cannot be moved. Pictures of landscapes. If I'm correct, the scenery around the castle could have served as the setting. Typical Irish weather. Actually, one should simply stay in bed on days like these. So, what do we have here? Knee socks? Long underwear. Nothing here that I might covet from the owner. Oops. What's this? An absolute dream. I could get any woman with something like this. If only Nina were here. A passageway. There are a few steps down into a dark passage. It smells rather moldy. I wonder what's waiting for me down there. A real torture chamber? I think something like this in a museum is really amusing. But when I look around here and imagine that people really were tortured to death here, I don't find it so funny anymore. It's obvious why that thing is called the Iron Maiden. The thorns are so sharp, I wouldn't touch them voluntarily either. I'll pour lamp oil into the groove that goes once around the sarcophagus. Let's give good old Lord Morangi a well-earned cremation. Maybe the story about him being a ghost here is actually true because he wasn't given a suitable burial. suddenly get really cold in here, or is it just me? Did I just imagine that, or...? I think I'd better take the coin out of the fire again, otherwise the gold will flow into the forge. The tip easily penetrated the gold coin. I think I'd better not imagine how it would look if I were stuck between these thorns. What was that? Sounds like I accidentally triggered some kind of mechanism again. Sounds like I triggered some kind of mechanism again. 